Hello friends who are young or young at heart at Dale City. I'm gonna do what I'm assuming most people who do this with you on Sunday mornings do, is invite you to come close. So take your phone or your tablet or your laptop, pull it close to you or scoot yourself closer so that we can be close with each other and hear and see each other. My name is John. I have two little kids who are probably the age of some of you. One is really, really little. His name is Otis, and he just turned one years old. And the other one is still kind of little, but not really little. His name is Arthur, and he's three. Now, Arthur has a thing that he absolutely loves to do, and that is to ride his bike. So I take him out to ride his bike all the time, and he gets it from his dad, who also really loves to ride bikes. But I like riding a certain type of bike. That's called a mountain bike. So you climb up big hills in the woods, past trees and rocks, and then you get really, really tired because you climbed up a hill. And then you get to ride all the way down the hill as fast as you possibly can. So I love doing that. And then I found something that'll let me do that with Arthur. Obviously, I don't take him on big mountains, but I have a special seat that goes right in front of me on my bike and special little handlebars that Arthur can hold on to. And we take my bike, my big mountain bike, out into what Arthur calls the mountains to ride in the dirt and the trees and the rocks and the roots. And we love it. We are both so happy because we're doing something that we both absolutely love to do. So what I want you to do is to think of one thing, one thing, that you love doing, that you could do every single day, every year, if you wanted to, all right? So think of that one thing, and on the count of three, I want you to say that one thing out loud. Say it out loud. If your parents aren't paying attention, make it really loud so they can start paying attention. All right, here we go. One, two, three. Those are great. Those are all amazing things to do. Those sound like so much fun, like coloring and playing basketball and talking with your friends and, and singing. Those are wonderful things to do. Now, what I want you to do is the next time, the next time you're doing that thing that you love doing, for a moment, take a break and I want you to think about God. Because what you're doing when you're doing something that you absolutely love doing is you're fully, what we say, living into who God has made you to be. You are appreciating all the things around us that God has made and given us. And then you are appreciating yourself as something that God has made because you are doing something that makes you happy. You're appreciating what God has made and you're appreciating yourself that is someone who was also made by God. So Arthur and I do this. When we're riding our bikes out, we take a moment, we're finished to say a prayer, to say thank you. Thank you for things like mountains and trees and gravity, which is a word that he now knows. Thank you for those things and thank you that we love riding bikes, that we love being active, that we love being together. So the next time you're doing your favorite thing, whatever it is that you just said super loud, for a moment, think about God being there with you and that you're doing something that God makes God happy. That is God is so happy that you're participating in this thing we call creation, right? That you're using something God has made and you're using all the things inside of you that God has given you. All right, let's say a prayer and then you can, I hope, you stick around for the rest of the service, um, but I get it, I get it, I remember if you, if, if you don't, but let's, let's pray. Loving and gracious God, we thank you for making all of us. We thank you for making this world all around us and for all the fun things that we get to do. We ask that you help us to be able to remember and to think of you when we are in the midst of something that fills us with a big word called joy that your presence, your very self is there with us, doing that fun thing with us. We thank you for our friends, we thank you for our family, and we especially thank you for this church. And we pray all of these things in your amazing and wonderful name. And all of God's people said, amen.